Hey guys, what's up? So today we are here with day one of the biannual bibliothon. I know you guys are just as excited as I am. So as you can see, today's challenge is my challenge and we are doing the DIY challenge today. So if you are entering into the DIY challenge, then you have the opportunity to win Volition by Lily Parody. This copy itself and guess what is really cool about it? First, it comes with this really cool Ignite postcard with kiss on it because Lily Sang is always kissing her books or kissing her postcards with black or pink lipstick so I think that is super cool um, but yeah you can use this as like a bookmark or something and then she also signed the inside for you guys so I think that is super cool. This book is fantastic. I absolutely loved it. I recommend anybody read it. So the person who wins this is getting a great book. Y'all did some really, really cool things last year and I am excited to see all the cool things you are gonna be doing this year. So without further ado, let's jump into the DIY that I did for the challenge. All right guys, so I decided to do a voiceover to tell y'all how to do all of the things for the DIY. So you're gonna need some rubbing alcohol, any nail polish color you want to use, a top coat, clear coat, um, a white nail polish, a nail art pen, a piece of like book paper or newspaper. And what I did is I just went ahead and painted the colored nail polish that I got onto three of my nails. You can choose whatever nails you want to do for this. Um, and then I always go over a second time just to be sure I got everything. And then I'm going to take that top coat, which I love Sachet Veet because it dries so fast. Um, and I put that over the colored nails. And then I use the white on the two nails that I did not paint with the colored nail polish. And I just go over it a second time to make sure I got everything. And then I'm going to just use the pink on my second hand. And the pink is an orly um, color that I got, an orly nail polish. And I don't know what color it is. I'll put it down below. Um, but yeah, I really like it. It's really good for summer. And then, uh, again, I just used the top coat over that pink. And then the white is, I think it's Laura Rail um, white. I don't know. Any white nail polish will work pretty much, though. You just want to be able to see the letters on your nail. And I just let those dry for a minute because you don't want to put the top coat on the white yet. So next, I'm going to pour some alcohol into the cap of the alcohol bottle just so that I have somewhere for it to sit so I can stick my nail down into it. And then you're going to take the one of the white nails and stick it into the alcohol and then take the book page and press down on top of the nail with the letters of the book page. I had to do it a second time for it to show up. Um, but now you'll see the letters came onto the nail so it works just by using the alcohol. So I'm going to do that to all of my white nails. You want to make sure you're using alcohol though um, so that the ink does come off onto your white nail and you want to use a very light color. So like I said, I always recommend using white or maybe tan for this. Then I took the nail art pen and I'm just drawing the Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows symbol onto the top of the one of the white nails with the print on it. I decided to use um, not my thumb but the other nail. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to use one of them rather than doing that on both of the white nails. And that's pretty much it um, as far as the design goes. And then I just take the top coat and I go over the white nail since you have not done that yet. And that's going to just kind of hold everything together. And yeah, that is a super easy um, nail DIY to do especially if you like books it's just super super easy so I hope you guys enjoyed that DIY video and I hope some of you will make really good use out of all the cool things I showed you how to do with your nails do not forget to leave the link to your DIY challenge in the comments down below and do not worry if for some reason it does not approve. We will be going through and approving all comments that for some reason get sent to spam. So I will see all of your videos and everybody will get a fair chance to enter. So I'm looking forward to seeing all of your awesome videos and don't forget to tune in tomorrow for the movie trailer challenge with Brittany.